Alright, this one's called Keep Fighting. Keep fighting, keep going, keep moving forward. Regardless of who's there or who's not there, regardless of the odds, regardless if you up or you down, poor, you rich, you you smart, you not, you whatever, whatever you on. Um, keep fighting, man, because that's just the way of the game, man. It's the game how this game of life is set up. Keep going. When you give up, you you <laughs> you, you quit, you give up. It's almost like a form of like dying for real. When you when you just quit and give up. And whatever that is, whether it's at your family, your goals, your dreams, your aspirations, your people, the, the new job you want to get, whatever. Like, keep fighting, man. Keep fucking fighting. I know it gets tiring. It makes you want to quit, because believe me, I done been there. I be there. I be there often, man. But you keep going. Life a marathon. It ain't no, ain't no fucking, uh, uh, it's, it's meant to be like this. Life's meant to be like this. If you don't keep fucking fighting, you give up, you become weak. Once you become weak, you become a victim. Once you become a victim, you can't do shit, you can't help nobody, you can't do nothing. You're going to sit back and try to get everybody else to do the things you're supposed to be doing, or you should have done, or you could be doing. Keep pushing forward, man. Keep pushing forward. All that quitting shit, get that quitting bullshit out your mind. If it's something that you really, really want to do. If it's not something you want to do, get up out of there and, and, and re-strategize. But keep fighting, man. For whatever, if you really want to do something, really want to be out here doing something, or you want to really be with that, with that, with that situation, or whatever you want to do in your life, man, keep fighting, man. Keep fighting for it. Any, any circumstance, situation you win, just keep fighting for it, man. Keep pushing. Because life designed this way to, get, to strengthen us, man. Try, when, when you get to a point where, like, you're seeing the bad times in your life as ways to become better, and ten times the human being you was before, that's when you become really a motherfucker on the next level because we love worshiping celebrities and these famous people rich people or people who we see that's in a, in a different place in life you know what i mean but those motherfuckers had to fight for that shit not everybody got this shit easy we think that sometimes some people think that oh yeah everything was easy for them no some of these people motherfuckers that we see as rich famous or, or really enlightened or smart or just powerful or have great relationships or whatever thing that you looking at that you want to do Motherfuckers had to go through hell. A hell that a lot of motherfuckers can't even take. A lot of motherfuckers can't take regular life, let alone the goddamn, the higher life, the higher paths of life. You know what I mean? A lot of these motherfuckers had to fight hard for this shit. And that's what you, you, that's what you gotta do, man. Look at this shit like it's designed to help you. Just like just like anything else. I'm really into fitness. I look at it like this. I look at life like, like a fucking training ground. You know what I mean? The heavier the weight that you got on you, the stronger you become in the long run. And the more shit you can do, the more powerful you become, the more, the more you can just have shit and, and do shit that you never thought you could have and do. But it's like, keep fighting, man. I keep pushing that weight up. Keep pushing that weight. And think about it. If, you have a, if, you put, if you're picking up a pencil versus a motherfucker who, who lifts in the car, who do you think really going to be stronger? And I know it's a, it's a crazy idea, but still, you know, y'all understand what I'm saying. Who do you think really going to be stronger, more powerful? Who really going to be able to enforce their will into reality? And make what the fuck they want happen happen. The motherfucker who's trying to lift, who can't lift a pencil, who can't do shit, can't get do nothing, nothing hard. Or motherfucker who out here flipping cars and doing some real wild shit. There's analogies, people. There's not nothing to take serious. I know some of y'all are gonna be taking this shit serious. Oh, flipping cars. But anyway, yeah, man. The hard, the harder your life, the stronger, the stronger you become out of it, man. Straight up. You know, if answer bust about it for real. And it's all about transforming how you think about things. If you look at things as, as if life, everything's designed to, to hurt you, or you're this victim, and everything gonna be, everything's designed to hurt you, make you feel bad, and hurt your feelings, and, and fuck you over, and shit like that. Life's gonna show it to you like that, man. Life's just a mirror of your, of your mind. Whatever, however your mind is, is operating, whether, how you, how you, whether it's unconscious or conscious, that's the reality you're gonna get. Motherfuckers who high-power people, or just in this different space, or whatever domain in life, they feel that way on the inside. That's why the outside reflects it. A lot of, a lot of the real work, man, it's going to be in your own mind, man. Your own mind, your own heart, your own emotions, your own spiritual practices. Physical shit, physical practices, man. Because everything is one. All is one. Nothing separate. But, yeah, keep fighting, man. That's some older story. Keep going. I'm in this race I'm in this race right with y'all, man. I fuck up and I suffer and I do all types of shit, stupid shit all the time, man. But because of that, I learned from it and become 10 times better every time. Every bad thing that ever happened to me, 
I always come back even stronger. That's a lot of y'all too. Y'all probably don't even notice that. <sighs> any any heavy weight that y'all been carrying in y'all lives, man. That probably bounced back ten times stronger, man. I believe in you.